Thanks for joining us again as we give you a scouting report on the upcoming opponent for the Tar Heels. This time it's Duke in Durham, Wednesday night at 9 o'clock. Veteran Tar Heel assistant Steve Robinson has the scout. And Coach, very good basketball team. And the Blue Devils seems like at least one of the things that jumps out to you, their balanced ability to score the basketball both inside and out. You stole what I was going to say <laughs> because that I would think that to me, that's that's been one of the big parts of their success is their balance. They got scoring inside with Jaleel, and then the outside they can they can knock down the three point shots, which they you normally can do. And now they have good balance. It is not a team that's just heavily dependent on one phase of the game. So they do provide a, a, a big task for us in terms of being able to defend both inside and out. And, you know, you kind of have to pick your poison a little bit in terms of which what area you try to attack. And uh, uh, but they're they're a well coached team. They're a good basketball team. They're playing with great confidence, and they're playing at home. Okafor, just a freshman, of course. What what makes him so skilled and special down low? Well, his mobility. He's got good footwork. He's got great strength. You know, he he has touch. You know, he can score the basketball. You know, some guys are just blessed with that ability that they can put the ball in the hole and he's one of those big guys that have that ability and uh, you can add to that humongous frame that he's got it does kind of uh, uh, he knows how to use it. Page one on one with Hood crosses over into the lane layup good. You mentioned them playing at home you guys play in tough environments every year uh, Cameron Indoor known as one of the tougher places to go play is, is there anything different about playing there? No, we all enjoy it. You know, it's just a, it's just a challenge. It's a challenge of playing the conference uh, that's at a high level. You know, the guys that were recruited to come here to play, they understand that they're going to get an opportunity to play at a high level in some hostile environments. And you know, you got to gear yourself for it and get excited about it and and uh, welcome the challenge. It's a challenge, and you know that, and you know you you understand what you have to do to prepare yourself to face that kind of challenge. Last thing, Coach Tarrios have uh, stumbled. Uh, a little bit here in the last couple of weeks. What in your mind is important for, for Carolina to get back going the way they want to? Play better. <laughs> <laughs> Pretty easy, we gotta right? play, Yeah, we got to play better. You know, we didn't necessarily play great basketball over this last little stretch, but, uh, you know, the good thing about it is you keep practicing, you keep working, and hope to improve. And, um, you know, it's got to get things clicking and get things going in our direction a little bit, but it's not going to happen. And just because we want it to, we're going to have to work and we have to outwork people in, in order to make that happen. Two of the final six games of the regular season will be against Duke. The first one comes in Durham Wednesday night at 9 o'clock. We thank Steve Robinson for help giving us a scouting report.